Hello, this is Coach Rich Campy, your thinking coach. Today's grin message, I am grateful for discernment. And the intentional message is BS. BS. BS, what, what do you mean BS? Belief systems. I remember one time I was running late at night on the golf course and I was running and I thought someone was following me so I kept running faster, faster, faster till I couldn't even breathe anymore and I was like, oh my gosh, I can't run any faster. It was really dark out. But every time I'd stop, the person stopped and I'd stop and the person stopped. And I was like, I just can't run anymore so I just stopped and then I realized as I started walking to catch my breath, it was my new sweatsuit. My new sweatsuit was running rubbing against each other on the legs and it appeared or it sounded like someone was chasing me but it wasn't true and I just kept running. I mean here's the reality we have a tabletop and the legs support that tabletop we call references so we have a lot of belief systems of things we think that are true that might not be so true but these belief systems drive us they create everything we do based on what we believe think about it if you believe that you're a $40,000 a year income earner or a $60,000 a year income earner, a hundred thousand or a million or a billion, that's what you start to create based on your belief systems. It all starts right there with the belief systems. I'll give you an example. Flying the drone at night, I wanted to have a good time with the boys. It was late at night. I flew it off the balcony, flew it out, wanted to fly it down and I crashed it twice into the table. I broke all the wings off it. It was crazy. You can check that out on some of the other videos that we had to see some of the shrapnel from it. But my belief system was, oh, you can't fly at night. It was a GPS issue. I was out of range with the wall. All these things. You know what it was? It was one simple cord, one simple plug-in that changed everything. It was my user error that caused the crash twice, but the whole time, I kept thinking it was a GPS issue, it was late at night, and all these other things. My belief system really could have caused me to never fly again off that balcony. How many times in life do we create a belief system around relationships, around finances, around our health? Example, I've tried that diet, I've tried that workout program a bazillion times. Really, a bazillion? It's never worked. I'm not doing it again. I fail every time. I've tried to get a better job. I've tried to be happy. You know what? It's easier just to stay unhappy because I've tried it so many times. It doesn't work. Try again. Try until dot, 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 right? Keep trying until you get the result you want. It's amazing through discernment and through understanding belief systems what we can create. Be careful. This is Coach Rich Campy, your thinking coach, saying be the first believer in your belief systems.